guys, welcome back. Adam Mickelson, one of the owners here at Capture Realty. And Ty DeVault, Adam's partner over at Capture Realty. Super excited to have you guys back. It's been about three months since you guys last saw the old unfinished home. Uh, last time we were here, it was down to the studs. The modern transformation has taken place. We're about to walk you guys inside. You can see here this boring split level is going to get a modern facelift. We're going to start with the garage doors. Both the garage doors are going to switch out with modern garage doors. Uh, the boring aluminum siding is going to get switched out with a modern flat panel siding and that's going to have a cedar accent. The cedar accent is going to go around the garage doors as well as up through the front door with a new fur front door. We're going to have a cedar deck going over the top of these cement stairs. All of the windows are getting switched out as well as the roof has already been replaced with new fascia and we're going to have new gutters. So the whole house is going to get a front facelift. So what we have here is our classic uh, 70s split entry home. Um, first goal is to just get this thing opened up, right? Take out this uh, wall here. This one's coming out as well. In an effort to continue to make the open floor concept, we removed the partition wall that goes between the kitchen, living room, and dining room. That will get replaced with an island that will have bar stools, a spot for entertaining. Uh, keeps kind of that great room concept. Uh, open and airy for our resale. We really want this place to look much larger than it actually is at the 2,000 square feet. Um, we're going to be replacing this entire kitchen. The entire kitchen is going to have new shaker panel cabinets. It's going to have granite countertops or quartz countertops, new stainless steel appliances. We'll probably run the hardwoods throughout the entire main level, as well as a nice tile backsplash. The, pot, the kitchen's really going to pop. We were able to knock this completely out. Obviously, you're going to have to re relocate some of the electrical, um, but that's going to give us a nice open feel uh, for this dining area. We're going to be scraping the popcorn ceilings. This really dates a 1970s, 1980s split level. So this will be get, got rid of. Um, we're going to scrape it all down and tape and texture it so it looks brand new again. All of the flooring throughout the main floor will get replaced. The nice hardwood flooring. And I'll take you down the hallway real quick and we'll see what we're going to do in the bedrooms. So both of these fixtures are going to get replaced. All of the doors are getting switched out. They'll be all brand new moldings and casings throughout the entire house. It looks like a big mess right now, but we ripped out the old vanity here. Um, this closet's going to go. We're actually going to sacrifice this closet to make the master bathroom larger, which is what I'm going to show you next. It feels a little tight in here right now. Um, this wall right here is that closet that I was telling you about on the other side. We're gonna take that closet out and open this shower up and then put a really nice rain head shower, all tile, it's gonna be beautiful. Now we're actually in the master bedroom. Um, as you can see, obviously, this wallpaper is going to have to go. All the baseboards are going to get changed out. We've got the old brown baseboards now. We're going to change that out with a nice white uh, square molding. There's new doors that are going to go in here, new shelving. We're going to trim this out all nice. Alright, so we stripped it down to the studs down here to reconfigure the floor plan to make it make a little bit more sense for us. Uh, this will become a bedroom slash office. It'll have a six foot opening opening up into the downstairs family room. Um, that'll make this house a four bedroom, 2.75 bath. Um, we have a three quarter bath in the master, we've got a full bath in the hallway, and this will become a full bath downstairs. sales price, Capture Realty puts together an ultimate listing presentation. We don't just put a sign in the front yard when we're selling a home, we actually go the extra mile. We stage every single one of our homes, we also do professional photography. We do drone photography, virtual tours, we do an ultimate open house, 
as well as we go ahead and syndicate with every online website. We also do target marketing on, marketing on Facebook in order to actually zero in the client that would be actually looking for this home. That creates an overwhelming response to our listings. The first weekend we had over 40 people through this home and it was a bidding war. There was multiple offers. We had a lot to choose from when we were selecting an offer. We were able to vet through the highest, best two offers and then go back to those buyers and eliminate some of the contingencies. The offer we actually accepted was able to drop their appraisal waiver as well as their inspection contingency. And we ended up selling the home for 40000 over the list price. We originally were planning on selling this home for 599000 and we're in contract about to close at 690000 When we first started out, we were thinking six hundred dollars for a sales price like Adam said. By the time we finished this house, it turned out absolutely beautiful. We looked at the market, we decided to go on at six forty nine dollars and take a risk. And we couldn't believe it when we were able to bring in so many offers, push the price up so high that we're now pending at $40,000 over that list price. Here at Capture Realty, we pride ourselves on hitting the highest sales price in every neighborhood. Selling your home is one of the largest investments and largest assets you're ever going to sell. You gotta choose the right agent when you're listing your property. We would love an opportunity to meet with you specifically and do a listing presentation for you. It's 2016, some of the methods have changed in listing and selling real estate. If you're not using technology to bring in the largest audience possible to all of your listings, then you're doing it wrong. Please contact myself or one of our agents. We would love to come out, walk your property specifically, and do a listing presentation for you. Thank you so much for joining us at our latest project. And we look forward to hearing from you soon. Oh,